What is going on, my fellow YouTubers? This is Ricky J, baby, from Ricky J Sports, and welcome to another installment of Random Ranked Fights, baby! And before we get started, oh, I need to send a quick shout out to a brother from another mother. Good old Crazy Kane 305. If you guys saw the last episode, the great opponent that was using John Jones, using those crazy combos, he was skipping around like Michael Jackson on the canvas. That was Crazy Kane 305. I was facing him in that video. I'll put the uh, link in in this video and that was crazy Kane and he sent me a message and he said I had my fingers crossed you would post this I just wish I could I would have took this fight more seriously not just not using Jones maybe you can start a redemption series where you let your subscribers get one more chance to beat you crazy Kane whenever you want to fight let me know man send me a message and we will battle and that was an epic fight Man, I'm telling you guys right here, if that went five rounds, that would have been Crazy Kane's fight, that's for sure. But anyhow, turning the page, people, we are using the middleweights right now. And let's quickly get into our first fight. Here we go. All right, our first fight. The reveal always gets me so nervous. Here we go. Who could it be? It's ah! Michael Bisbig, baby! <laughs> yes! I love the count. Here we go. All right, look who we're facing. We are facing Dan Henderson. And remember, guys, they fought twice before. Man, the first time was at UFC 100. I remember that, man. Dan Henderson just shut the lights off on Bisbing. So here we go. I got to be careful. You got to watch out for the H-bomb, which is Henderson's right hand. Oh, but in this game, it's his left hand, too. So we gotta be careful. Oh no! And I gotta, I can't get into a slugfest with them. Already, look at my guard, my blocking. I can't get those forearms up. Oh my gosh, I'm getting cut up here, people. Right away, what a start to this middleweight video. And I feel like hmm, this guy is hunting me down, man. Gosh. Oh, this is fireworks right away. Oh, good left hand. Both men came out hard. I gotta get oh, really every time I go for that body kick, body he's countering kicks. it with yeah, an overhand absolutely. or a straight. Excellent job of timing these And Bisbig requires volume to finish his opponent, even in the game, man. But Hendo could knock you out with Very one punch. So I'm on my bike. Nice Remember to circle away from here. It's L1 and right analog. Oh my gosh. Hold L1. I'm going to do that big step away. The big step away really helps. See that? Just stepping away, being patient. The flurry sort of has slowed down from Dan. Come on, Dan. Did you guys see the jujitsu match he had with the grappling match he had with John Jones? He's keeping his hands up and it was almost damage. like they wanted to strike, but they didn't strike. I won't tell you who Bisping won. I don't want to be a spoiler. You can hear that this one. guy is a hunter, man. My opponent, Just he's hunting me down. Clock. I've sort of neutralized him at this point, but he's not afraid of my stand-up. Oh, I, I guess uh, Bisbing doesn't have the overhand. Solid right by Henderson. Whoa, <laughs> I got to just back away, man. <laughs> It's almost like when you're picking on a schoolyard bully and you hit him once and then you just run and you bolt for the field. <laughs> That's what I'm doing right here. Hitting him one time and then run. <laughs> Hitting him once and run. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Gotta get out of this. And thank you so much to everybody with the nice comments the about the clinch. Clinching strategies. So I got out of there. But he this guy's really gassing himself out by throwing the heavy leather. The, <laughs> the heavy leather is being thrown early. Oh, and Bisbing with a little pushback. Nice. Yes, just touching him, baby. That's my line. Just got to touch him. But my right arm. See my right arm there? Got to be careful. Good job blocking the punch. Wow, well that definitely wasn't my round. 
But you know with Bisbing, for all my UK English buddies, I love you guys. Michael Bisbing is like the UK fan. He's tough as nails. It's not going to take one round to take out the tough Englishman like Michael Bisbing is. He's got to come after me. And I think this guy is. But you know what? His gas tank. He's going to have to refuel. And he, and he can't in a fight right here. So that's the one thing I have is the toughness, durability of Michael the Count Bisbing. I can't do an English accent. <laughs> hey, Woodley wanted to go after Bisbing. Did you guys hear about that? Woodley wanted to take on Bisbing. Who do you think would win in a fight between Woodley and Bisbing? But now Woodley's facing Thompson, my guy, baby. The Wonder Boy, Stephen Thompson. At UFC 209, I believe. Hopefully we'll see some Diaz brothers in there because it's 209. That's where they're from. That's their area code for Stockton, baby. Stockton, California. Man, I got to back away. Yeah, Ricky, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to be on it, man. Live or die, die or live. I don't know if that makes any sense, but I'm going to be at UFC 209. You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> Sorry, my throat, but everything else is whatever. <laughs> Look at this turn of events. Nate Diaz. He, I'm channeling my inner Nate Diaz right here. And I'm doing a lot better in this round. I, fi I find with this guy keeping my distance, going with the straight punches and kicks, it's working. He can't hit me when I'm at that distance. And I'm trying to go off first. I'm trying to be first. I usually try to counter fight, but here I'm trying to go first. And then dodge and then counter. Oh my God. That's oh, outstanding yeah. defense. I feel like I can't get comfortable in this fight. This guy is just hunting me down. Kudos to him, man. This strategy works. If you're able to use a striker like Dan Henderson and hunt guys down, this strategy works. Look at my arms. <laughs> it's like I put them in the oven <laughs> for Jet Red or he went tanning for too long. But I'm just constantly moving. Oh, he lands the roundhouse and I'm okay with this. I feel nice like he's going to gas out at Good some point. Those overhands take a you lot out of you. Job of oh, boy. <laughs> but Bisping seems to be slowing down and a bit. Misses. Oh, my. Good roundhouse kick to the oh, that was the magic comp. If I hit that head kick, he would have gone down. Yes. Oh, look at Bisping showing the cardio. You can't coach cardio. Yes, just trying to touch him. Look at Hendo's body in the diagram. He can't. I'm noticing his block. He can't block right at this point. He needs to switch stands. See that? He can't get his forearms up. Oh, he stepped on a nail. <laughs> Did you see that? He stepped on a nail and went down. And he is, oh, saved by the bell. You know that was your favorite show if you were a 90s, 80s kid. Look at that. <laughs> oh, he definitely got saved by the bell. And I think I stole that round, man. I so think I, so, I stole that round, and we are 1-1, one, one, and, and this is overtime. Got to win the round or try to finish him. Oh, the, see the back of the head there? That's illegal. Dan's gasping for hair. I didn't know he had Hume. He has Hume in his corner. I did not know. Was that him? Was that, him? Was that Hume? You ready? You ready? The master Hume. He, 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 he coached Rich, Rich Franklin for such a long time. During the days when Anderson Silva was taking his nose and rearranging Rich Franklin's nose, man. I felt so bad for Franklin. Especially the second fight. Everybody's like, don't don't turn away from him. Turn into him. Remember when Anderson had the plum? But anyway, let's not turn away from Hendo. I'm not afraid of you, Hendo. Actually, I am afraid of him because that Hendo bomb, you don't want to eat that. Oh, and he's parrying now. Oh, boy. Remember, his body shot. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt on wobbly legs. 
gotta push, baby. Push. Oh, he went for the high kick. Oh, the body's right there. The body's right there if I can catch him. Keep it pushing, baby. Whoa, I just dodged that. Nasty combinations here. Oh, the uppercut on the way down. Hendo's in trouble. Oh, what a victory, baby. Yes. Yes. Wow. Wow. He is as tough as they come. You know how the English boys do. What a battle. Wow. What pressure Dan gave me, this guy gave me, eh? And then I just backed away and I was calculating. Anyhow, let's get in another fight. Hang on. All right, let's see who we are going to control, man. What a first fight. Oh, I'm still recovering. So let's see. Who are we going to control? I'm nervous. I'm nervous. My thumb is shaking. It's crazy. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, it's Dan Henderson. Dan Hendo, baby. I can't believe it. Let's see if we can get Hendo win after suffering that devastating loss. Hang on, people. All right. Look who we're facing. One of my idols, man. <laughs> Anderson, the Spider Silva. And if you guys are tuning in for the first time, I do a decent Anderson Silva impersonation. I got to improve it, but I, I'm, I'm working on it. So here it is. What would Anderson say? Let's pretend we're interviewing Anderson Silva for this fight. So, Anderson, what are your thoughts on facing the legend Dan Henderson? Even though you did fight him back in the day in the UFC, what are your thoughts on facing him now? Well... Thank you, Ricky, for for interview me. But uh, personally, I think uh, he on uh, steroid. He probably uh, eats the steroid or puts it in his uh, tushy. But uh, personally, I think he not the best. His team not the best. I'm the best. That's it. And uh, I come for fighting. I come for Ed Source. I come for Dana, Lorenzo, and PJ Penn. Anyhow, thank you, Ricky, and enjoy the fight, G. <laughs> here we go. This opponent here likes to watch the intros for some reason. But anyway, facing Anderson, you know you're going to get the strikes. You know you're going to get the clinch, so I'm aware of that. So here we go. I got the H-bomb in our corner now. <laughs> I'm going to try. <laughs> I tried using it right away. <laughs> You can't throw it right away like that because he knows it's coming. And it comes slow because he really has to load up on it, eh? He really has to load up on it. But Hendo doesn't have... Oh, no! Down he goes already. Anderson's taunting you. Oh. He doesn't have a front high kick. Wow, Anderson. Anderson seems fast. Oh, a little spin rooney right there. Once they do that spin, just go to the body. Once you see it, go to the body. They'll stop it. Or jab. Anderson's taunting you. Oh, boy. Yes. Go, Hendo. You can't eat a lot of those. Oh. Oh, I'm going kind of unload. Got, oh, no. See, up. <laughs> I was fighting at a character right there. See that, guys? Man, you can't make that mistake of unloading the tank, especially against a good opponent like this. But I was getting carried away in the moment. Uh-oh. I gotta manage that stamina. This guy is a flashy fighter. Man, he's doing a good job at... See, when he's going up and down like that, it's tough. It's tough for me to predict where he's going. And my body, I gotta be careful with. He's really taking out my body. Oh, there's the H Bob! I told you! <laughs> you, I told you guys, and I gotta push forward, and he's backing away, and I gotta really touch his face, man, with some leather. Because this early in the fight, he's gonna recover. Oh, you're hearing the thuds! There's another H Bob! Another H-bomb. 
But again against Anderson, he's never out of it. Oh no. Oh no. Just backing away. Yes. Oh, Anderson. He's like he's on skates for the first time. What? How do I go down? Hendo has his egg scrambled big time because how did he go down on one shot? I was putting it to him. Oh, and he's rocked. What a round. This is the craziest round ever. Back and forth action. Unbelievable. Who do you, who has this round, man? Wow, he's got to respect Henderson's power. Oh, what a round. Oh, man. We both had two knockdowns right there. Unbelievable. See, this game doesn't have draws, but I would, I would score that round 9-9. Unbelievable. That, my friends, is what I call exciting MMA action. Guys just both going for it. We're not sitting in full guard. We're not giving each other a nice warm blanket on the mat. We're working hard on the feet. Oh, and Anderson's hurt! Get him! Get him! What? Get him! Hendo's stuck in the mud. Come on, Hendo. Channel your inner Usain Bolt, baby. Get some speed. Hunt him down. With a faster fighter, I think I would have caught him. Unbelievable. So now Anderson. Oh, no! What? Oh, my gosh. That just came out of nowhere. Oh, my gosh. I can't let him posture up. No way. No way. I got to clear the cobwebs. Clear the stars. No, he's not going to let me up. What am I thinking? I'm more in shock that, look, two shots and I went down. So at this point, he's scoring big points. Three-round fight. Under three now. This is crazy. Because in the first so right moment of this round, it was all me, and then all of a sudden, it was all him. Nah, nah, nah. You're not getting that and mount. Oh, and look up. at this. He wants it back up. Now, I've been rocked a bunch of times. i got to be careful. Oh, listen to that thud. Are you guys hearing that at home? Anderson's winning the fight apparently. Good roundhouse kick to the midsection. Oh. Get him. He tags him with the punch. See his length is is saving him in those exchanges. He did a nice job blocking the head kick. He was looking for it. Yes, that belly tickling is available for me. Nice job. Try to disguise that overhand. It's coming slower though. It's coming slower. <laughs> Big oh. oh, no, no, no. Oh, no. I am in trouble. Desperation takedown. I got to run for the fields. Time out. Time out. I got something in my eye. Oh, no. Oh, my. This is not good. Back away. Back away. Come on, Hendo. Wow. He sort of survived. No. Oh, my gosh. Zombie mode. Oh my, oh, can't win them all. My heart is broken, but Hendo, he put up a good fight, man. Unbelievable. Anyhow, people, thank you so much for stopping by. That was fun. Win or lose, who cares, as long as we're having fun, enjoying some fights. This is Ricky J, baby, from Ricky J Sports, and you are awesome.